All right, guys. This one I'm kind of excited about. It was kind of cheap. I mean, I'm not like jumping for joy, but I got it from my favorite watch store on eBay. I think I've mentioned it before. And I really was interested in the strap. I thought the strap looked really cool. There's some junk in here. All right. But anyways, I want to see what it looks like. It is a Nautica. Ooh. Very nice. All right. Let's watch a video and then we'll go right back into the review. guys so I've been holding out on you guys and uh, I've had this one for a while um, it is the Nautica uh, Acro Beach I think it's what it is um, it is nice uh, I I saw this watch for sale on eBay and I just I, I had to get it I mean look at this this fantastic looking and, and in particular is the watch strap. It's a suede, a green suede watch strap. I think it just has like a fantastic look. And, you know, unfortunately, I, I really, I think this might be just too bright, this color. Well, let me see if I turn this light off. Yeah, because I want you guys to really see the color of this, um, of this here. The bezel really stands out and even the face is sort of a greenish gray. I mean, it's a black and it's it's so awesome. I don't even know where to start. Like, it's really, really a nice, uh, nice watch. You know what? I'll start off with the price. Okay. I don't remember what I paid for it, but I know it wasn't a lot of money. Uh, this is the um, MSRP, $89. Now, that is a good price. I mean, this watch, now the, the watch strap is a nice thick watch strap. This is worth every penny of that $89, but I know I didn't pay that. I probably paid something like $50 or something. I'll put it up there. Uh, I'm sure I can find how much I paid. So I think I paid around 50, but I would not be surprised if I paid much less. Um, it's just fantastic. I'll, I'll just go over the case. Um, snap back case, it, uh, it is water resistant. 50 meters water resistance, which is not bad. Um, you know, that's good. You can go swimming in it, but it's a leather strap, so I wouldn't do that. Um, you can shower, or you can just go about your day. I think 50 meters, honestly, in my opinion, is the perfect water resistance for something you don't plan on swimming in, but that you're just not concerned will ever get, will ever get ruined, right? So you can just actually wear it and just go about your day. Um, yeah, I mean, just fantastic. I mean, everything about it, the crown feels good. Um, it's uh, It's got a fantastic face. I mean, just look at that. I'll, I'll put a really nice picture here, a close up so you can see it, because I am not doing it justice. It is a black anodized case, um, brushed, and uh, just, just gosh, really fantastic. I mean, I can't say enough about it. Uh, the bezel is, is also steel. Um, this, I believe, is ceramic. I'm really impressed by it. Uh, it does not have... Um, it, okay, this is actually part of the case. So, I mean, I guess there you go, right? This this does not actually spin. It's part of the case. But, you know, you can... Okay. Like I said, I live across the street from a park. <laughs> Somebody felt like honking their horn. So there you go. Um, but just everything about this design is just truly fantastic. I mean, it's such a good looking watch. This of course is one that I'm gonna have to keep cause I mean, why not, right? Uh, who, who's the guy just one more watch? You know, and it's so true, just one more watch. Um, <laughs> but yeah, fantastic, fantastic watch strap. Really supple, it feels good, I love it. 
um, and the buckle is also the same same steel. Uh, it's it's really really nice. Um, Loom, which I'm going to go straight into, is really good. I'm going to put a picture, but I also want you guys to see it because I'm just impressed. Um, it's just well, I guess you're not really going to get to see it. But, oh yeah, yeah, there you go. And then I'll put a a better picture of it up here somewhere so you can kind of see. But really good and it really holds it too like i don't know what this is specifically but it really really holds the uh the loom now the uh the, the watch movement's actually pretty good too uh, i was pretty impressed it's a vx 32e and i'll put pictures of that up here as well um for a watch that's under hundred dollars intentionally under hundred dollars where they're not even going to charge the msrp that is a decent decent movement i mean um, that's, you know, it's, it, it's not, it's not like an expensive movement by any means, but for an inexpensive fashion watch, which Nautica is, um, it's a decent movement. So that one is going to last, it, it's going to last the life of this watch. Um, you'll probably get two, three battery changes out of it before, before it's, it's shot. So, but yeah, I mean, gosh, what can I say about it? It's fantastic. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do the measurements. Forty-three. That's twenty, I think. Yep, twenty. And depth is twelve. Lug to lug. Forty-nine. Say forty-nine. And then we'll do the weight. Seventy three. All right. What can I say? There it is. Hardened mineral crystal, stainless steel case. Really just an all around fantastic watch. I mean, you cannot go wrong with this guy. It is just a fantastic, fantastic watch. So, and I'm keeping it, not selling it. All right, if you like this and you wanna see more Nauticas, I know I got a couple Nautica fans out there. Uh, let me know in the comments and please subscribe. I appreciate it.